Hey, Kajudo you know, fans, this is Carl Rich, and we are at Kong Asylum for the fourth and final round of the Kajudo Blue Days here. Uh, round three, I had a bye. So, my fourth round opponent is Mr. Hunter. Hunter B. And uh, it's really cool that you're in your first country tournament. And she wins! Nice! Uh, um, your, it's your first time coming, so I know some of your cards are, are open and standard, so it's okay. Actually, Oh, good! Even better! I put in all the mystics. Okay, cool. And I'm playing the prep deck with the Ravzerker promo. I roll on two. Ten. 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 Seven, so I have choice. And I'm gonna play. Oh, I have choice, so I'll play. And you found Kaijudo through your Netflix. That's you just like anime. When I was about eight, I was just scrolling through Netflix. Are you not? No, eleven. Nice. And then you found out that there was a. Uh, yeah, it, it was. It, it, I saw it. Uh, the first time I came into this store, which was actually a, a few uh, months ago. Yeah. Oh, you were using this for the first time. Trying to get his first day, but let's see. Uh, two weeks. Two weeks ago. Yeah. Oh yeah. And so I, I talked uh, to her once. Oh, oh. It was your mom, your friend. Starts with an N. His name is Nico. Nico. I knew it was Nico. Uh, decided to come up and play in the tournament. <laughs> Mom's probably gonna play next week. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Nico, maybe. Look at this. Let's see how Bob. Community's been giving you lots of cards. Uh, they gave that to you. Yeah. Um, I think it's just a dark one. Dr. Rock. Robert Nestor. Yep. Yeah. Oh, we're gonna give you a bunch of cards. I'm gonna pass her. But you found the store. Decided to play today. You love the game. It's a good time. Very fun. I tried to teach one of my friends, and when I told him about the tap, he would tap the card. Oh, that's funny. That's funny. I tap them like this. Yeah. I didn't even thought of it that way. Yeah. I'm going to put the timer on. Sure. I tap the two. Oh, a warmer. Nice. But the card's crunchy. No. It's just the term they use. It's the Spanish when they learn about it. Michael? Michael? Happy no. Oh, absolutely. I'm going to play an Ethereal Agent with Snoop ability. I get to look at one of your shields. And only I do. Okay, nice. Go ahead. We're going to pass Because he's a blocker, he can't attack. Mm -hmm. But from a mom's perspective, you like it. Yeah, I think it's me. I like that it's got a little strategy to it. Mm -hmm. uh, let's move this guy up just a little bit. Give you something a little bit more room in your band. Very simple. Black feather. Quite hard to master. I'm telling you, first time black feather. There can only be a we're super excited you found this. Ooh, now you've unlocked three of your colors. Nature. Dice on him just so I know that he's tied right. So I can't attack with him next turn. Uh, you I like evolution creatures, so I'm going to evolve my opposition into a ice belly blowfish. He's going to attack, and I'm going to unleash. Return target enemy creature to his owner's back. Turn that guy's hand. 
I know what that one is. So I'm break this one. Shield blast? Nope. Go ahead. Since it's your turn, this time rhyme's gonna go with Did you draw? No, it's true. It's alright. You gotta draw for turn. It's a cool name, right? Draw for turn. Yes, he's on Spiceable. Cool flavor. Uh, your turn. Each uh, each civilization has a characteristic. Blue likes to draw cards and bounce. Nature likes to have big beef and go to Manazo. And then for fire, they got Fire Nation. Fire they like to have a strong attack. Yes, power attack, actually, just like this guy. And the darkness, they like to get big. Yes. And bad. Uh, level five. He's a big old dragon. Uh, when he attacks, he gets plus three thousand power, double breaker. And my first creature to attack is unblocked. So, volcanic burns. <laughs> and you're right. And when he attacks, he's going to So, I know what that one is. I'm going to break this one. So you're not going to attack again? No, I can't because he just he just hit about it. Now this guy can attack that one. Shield blast? No. It's coming next turn. Go ahead. Alright. Untap your bed. Oh, yeah, draw a card. You do a great turn. Okay. Here. Right, there I go. No. Scare. <laughs> Now he comes in about he enters tap. Because he's got four of it. I'm going to attack you can only do four. Because this one, because there's two colors, he enters the mana the mana's are tapped. So you wouldn't be able to tap him for five. But you can change it if you want. If you want to take it back, you can. Sure. It's all good. But I have a double breaker, so you may want to play something for it. Like maybe a blocker or two. Yeah, you can do that. Because you, you've unlocked your colors, and you have four mana available. I want to, but I also want to summon. Oh, wait, I do have a so, yes, now you have five of it. Sure. Yeah, now that you, like, that's a blocker, which is good. And you can attack, and inspiration is creature that takes about to reveal a water spell that's spell Now the cool thing is, whenever you can search your deck, you can figure out what's right here. It's a very cool, uh... No, no, these are your shields. You can't, you can't search through this. But process of elimination. You're like, okay, if I run three terror pits, it only works here, two are there. So, it's really cool. There's a lot of cool things you can learn from, from searching your deck. And generally, it's a water ability. Sometimes nature. But for the most part, it's... Water is actually the most... Strategery. This guy's a block. <laughs> no, you don't have another time run? Oh. Well, that is unfortunately. But I, I know that sometimes. one of these has to be the spell of the mystic. You're not supposed to reveal that to the And what you want to do is, you want to just give this a quick shuffle. Just give it a quick shuffle. It's alright. And then let your opponent cut it. Which is all good. Just to keep it fair. Now, this guy can attack. He's a powerful attack. You can attack this guy. Or this guy. Now, that's a trade. Because they're both fives. Is that cool? I'm willing to do that. Alright. Now, he has an ability. He's on Slice of He's good. Micah? Okay. 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 I'm going to tap two. And play a name uh, uh, This guy cannot be blocked. 
He's really cool. He's evasive like that. So I'm going to break that shield. And then I'm going to trump card. <laughs> Do you have shield blast? No? No? It's good stuff? And then I'm going to attack with my flame. That, I mean, my flame. Sure. You can block or you can take the shield. I know what that one is. That's a rare creature. It's okay. We're it's all good. We're learning. We're gonna pass her. It's all good. We're having fun. It's all good. I mean, if, if you can, I, if you can. Walk away learning just one thing every time. You know, how are you doing? It's one of those things. I'm sure he's, he's, he's sponging up all these things. Oh, yeah. His brain is really like that. It's much better than mine. Yes. So you have this, you got this extra mana from last turn, so you got one, two, three, four, five, six. So you can actually go to seven. First. Did you want to did you want to charge mana first? Or no? I, I'm gonna tap those little mana. Well, you have to charge first. There's only one charge step. They keep it simple like that. He's, he has the ability to, after he draws, he can charge once. Charge a man. Put, put, a, put a card down here. Yes. Now you have seven available man. What would you like to do? Here's that blocker. There she is. Oh yeah. Now you have five available mana. What I'm gonna do with these? Nice. Some gigahorn charger. That lets you go search. For a creature. With the power of seven. Five. 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 Yeah. Exactly. I choose Mystic Flight. Nice. Very nice. That goes to your hand. Shoot my hand. And then I shoot my deck. My opponent. Good job. Absolutely. Yes. Doing great. And is it my turn? Uh, yes. Okay. I'm going to untap. I'm going to draw the card. And I'm going to use some of my I'm going to use some of my creature tricks. Okay. Um, this creature has volcanic current. The first creature you attack on the streets cannot be blocked. So he's going to use it himself. So he can't be blocked. But I'm going to pick that shot. No. no shield blast? Should be the red right shield. Then I'm going to use uh, the sneak of this creature. He can't be blocked. So I'm gonna, we're going to go to game two. I'm going to draw back. Is that cool? All right, let's go to game two. Absolutely. I was one away from He's very fragile, but he does kind of cool stuff if he's not answered. So let's shuffle up and play game two. Absolutely. Very cool. Well, actually, the, the deck that you start with, next starting next week. Starting next week, yeah, you have to keep that one the same way all the way through all of the whole turn. Yeah. Just to keep it fair. Starting next week. Well, that makes sense. Yeah. 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 And then you start to know other people have yeah. it done too. Right. And then, uh, uh, yeah, give yourself a really good shuffle. Some people do pile shuffling. Oh, do me a favor. Um, after you shuffle, you want to present it to your opponent and let them cut. It's just a way to, a way to be fair. Cool. Alright. And then, uh, since, uh, since I won, you have choice of play or draw. You get to look at your five cards. 
So he's going to hit it a bit as a tap, and then I'll pass her and so we're going to drop. It's very brutal. No, These that's great. Right. Uh, I, 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 I know. It's helping being silent. It's very narrative. <laughs> One of them. That was that was the creature that was in your shields when I got to look at you. He basically gets you. Uh, my turn. It's my overwatch. I'm going to play a Hammer Addict, which has a really cool ability, uh, Purging Flames, which means I get to discard a card and draw a card. So I'm going to discard a Flame Serpent and then draw a card. So now I'm going to cast her. You know what's interesting? What's, which guy? You got one too? I actually have to stay. I would stay for this week. Watching some of your unboxings and... Did you really? Oh, that's... Yeah, that... He, he, you have seen some, some of my YouTube stuff. That yeah. warmed... That totally warms my heart. Yeah. Makes me... I've makes me super happy. I've uh, also watched TKC. TKC? Yeah. yeah, Corey, you got a fan. You got, you got a fan out there, Corey. I watched him. I watched him. Yeah. Yeah. He's an awesome guy. I got to work with him. Yeah. Yeah. Love to do it again. Hopefully that'll happen. Let's see what Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm going to put this in my mana zone. I'm going to play Tideseer, which allows me to read the shells, which means I, it's reversed on this one. I get to draw a card. Show the camera. I won't look. I promise. I get to draw a card and discard it. I'm going to discard my laser eyes. But I'm going to, I'm going to attack my ever at it. Show blast. Should I? No. Oh, what? Nice. Power. Absolutely. I do have lots of blockers in my deck, so that can be, that's what you meant by seeing it later on. You had two of them. I see what you're saying now. This game is it's a resource management game. You only get it's kinda of like money. You only get one dollar every turn. And you can add your dollar. You can add your dollars up every turn. And this costs three dollars. That's a bad analogy. It's just one way to explain it to people. So and then next turn you have four dollars you can spend. Two two dollar creature, one three. Yeah, it's amazing. Uh, so I did this and I'm not gonna summon anything. And it's risky, but I'm going to attack with that. I'm actually going to attack with this creature. Attack. That, that's you. Shield blast? No, actually. Then pass turn. Which game? Don't tell me. Don't tell me. That's the point of this game. There's a lot of auto. And there's, there's creatures that can come from shields. There's spells that can come from shields. There's so much. The thing is, you have to give your opponent cards to win. That's the beauty of the game. You have to give them cards. Unless they run out of cards. But the thing is, they have every opportunity to use those cards. And even, even, uh, uh, uh like you gotta give them cards to attack them one more time. Sometimes it's easy just to go, peck, 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 peck. 
we were just doing alpha strike and one time. Well, we're 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 drop? Yes. Okay, cool. Good, good, good. He comes to tap. That's right. Very good. And you have two, three. I'm going to... Did you want to summon something? No. Okay. Because I didn't have enough. I'm waiting. That's all good. Totally cool. So what do you do when you summon something? What do you do? Uh, you have to turn all the cards in one direction. Tap. Exactly. So if you have a half on your three cards, three stated for two three. Yes, he's double breed. Very good. Uh, uh, it enters the map. Uh, okay. Okay. Which means you can't use it. So you that can't use it. It has to be. And then sometimes creatures will hit the bottom zone tap as well. Very, very infrequently. But so it comes in tap, but you can still only use three. Yes. Ah. Yeah. But I choose not to use it because of my. Kind of an interesting thing. Uh, this is a, a water and darkness creature. But. Technically, you're unlocking water, so you have the ability. So, yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Bobby and the community. Bobby and DeAndre. You can't use those cards. Yeah. But, uh, I want to do. I'll look through them later. Oh, cool. Actually, we're going to give her some co cards so she can unlock creatures. Um, but yeah, uh, if he wanted to play a free cost water creature, he could. Because once you unlock it, it's just like a video game. That's the whole philosophy behind it. unlocking it. It's because a lot of people have the video game telling I saw people playing the game online. I heard that I heard that I heard that I I'm, I'm the same way. I don't own a console yet for that exact reason. I'd rather, I'd rather sit across from you and, and, and pick your brain and you pick my brain. Exactly. It's why I'm waiting for Assassin's Creed. Because it's a, it's a co-op it's a co-op game, sorry, it's a co-op game. You guys are both smiling, you almost love this game. It's so funny. So, okay, we're back to attack step. And you have two choices. You can attack this creature or one of my shields. You have a bigger power. I really And you're also you're also low on shields. Cool. And I have a cool ability called Protector, which means that if you're attacking one of the creatures, these creatures will kind of block or step in. You mean like it'll, instead of running... Instead of running this one to get banished, we'll this banish this guy. Yeah, this is a cool little thing. Uh, My turn. Thank you. Ooh, I just keep drawing multis. I'm gonna put this one in my mana zone. Tap two. Oh, we're gonna give you like these, these years too. Uh, they're mainly common to the common. Thank you. Everyone here is so excited. Everyone here is so excited. It's like Christmas. Uh, and I'm gonna tap it. We can talk. We can talk. I'm gonna attack that shield. shield? Yes, yes, sir. Shield blast? Uh, no. Where your time rides at? So we're gonna untap. Untap, drop. Uh, Shield blast? 
Go ahead. So one hundred ten. Draw a card. Absolutely. Oh, you do have most cards. Yeah, that's right. We were trying those last time. Too. Nice. Grimmy cast a spell. Choose one of your bridge shields. This creature breaks that shield. Well, you might want to get rid of this guy. I mean, you want to use this guy to do it. He's a powerful attack. He has 4,000 power. So my three back. Uh oh, you got a double breaker. This guy breaks two shields. Comic Asylum. Even though the name of Asylum is in the name, you're not crazy. I like, I think I like you best. Well, thank you. Thank you. That, that warms my heart. I try to grow the game, man. This game is amazing. Uh, I am going to break your shield. Yes. 
I like Macari. She's one of my favorite characters. I think you do remember the episode. Is it really? Yes. When uh, like Cho took control of Tritone Oh yeah. And started a war between Fire and Water. That's season one, kind of towards the end, right? No, it's season two. I believe the first. I believe it's the first and third episode. Uh, I mean, I know I see a couple of And then there's the nature, the nature of things like after that. I was going to get to it. I mean, I never hear anything talking about four and six. It's a different, it's a different I think it's the, 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 uh, the artifacts. You know, um. I'm just going to put down one of these. Uh, tap. Like the sword, the cape, the helmet, they all size to the, yeah. to either a creature or a human sprinkle. I like how they do that. Like, oh. I know you, I think I know that he's I really love how you've seen every episode for a point. Oh yeah. And I think that my favorite episode is the episode where Alex is jealous from casting the Cloak of Darkness, Cloak of Dark Illusions. But I love clothes. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Another book to see? Oh, okay. You just have to give those awesome sound effects. I'm going to put down a second one. Sure, you did a second one. Lots of it. Wow, nothing turned one, two, or three. Oh, it's just that all the parts of my hair are very much like five minutes. Put a tight seer in there? Yeah, you have to tell me. You can't sell it. I threw up an attack with that rock. I'm kind of excited. This video is going all over the place. I love it. I like it. I like it. It's going to be fun to watch. Yeah. It might be a thing. I'm going to get more players. Now you should be able to play something. My guess is you're going to play Karate Kid. I don't want to play Mono Red. No. That's the first picture for the show. Yeah. Uh, then I'm going to put some tight tap all of them. 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 Tight tap all of Really <laughs> good. Either way, you can get it. Whatever you want. Oh, I think it's so good. Yeah, nice. I'm going to play a scrappy one. And you don't have 1,000, so I can't banish you. But I will attack. Attack shield. Shield blast? Yes. Time rhyme. This is my only other attacker, so you can time rhyme me. And pass rhyme. Well, technically, you can do that guy. It's a pretty good one. I wouldn't do this. I'm This guy. What do you want to What do you want to charge? What do you want to sell? I. I. It's all good. Ooh, he's covering. I like how he's like walking on top of it. He's running for feet. I think I'll play this. Did you have a scourge? Oh, I was just saying, I got one. You don't have a three or a two or a four on. No, this is like, I only have like two threes and you saw them. It's all good. What would you like to attack? I'm going to attack. Yeah, I can block or I can let it go. I'm going to let it go. Frozen! Am I going? Yeah. He also has a sister. Yes. Clearly. Elsa? No, just my little sister. Okay, There's two characters. Elsa and... Anna. Anna. Anna and Elsa. Yeah, yeah. I have a niece. I have a couple of nieces. I'm going to play a really big creature. I'm going to play a promo. Nice. 
Put on one of my water creatures. Do you need that No. Let's see. Yeah. Yes, evolutions can do that. They evolutions of any color. They can attack. Uh, we'll get you some. Be aware, my friend Nico is breathing very deeply. He's wondering who. I'm actually going to attack that guy. He's bigger. So why would and then I'll attack a shield. Shield blast. Attack one more. Shield blast. Yes. Nice. I think one creature times 3,000 until the end of my turn. Wouldn't you want to get rid of one of these guys? No, because really, right now, he's my biggest priority. Being the most strong creature, being the biggest threat. But when it becomes your turn, the negative three will go wet. So, there you go. And then I'll pass you. No, 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 that's your ship. Are you sure you didn't want to hold on to that? He's a blocker. I'm sorry. You gotta be a little defensive. Yeah, there you go. And I'm wanting to see my sticks. It's what you need. We need a blocker. Yeah. Yes, four left over. Can you play anything else? Uh, All right. Micah? I don't believe I do. That's right. We'll make sure it's all straight next time. And then hold on to that. And then this guy. I'm going to use his really cool unleash ability. When he attacks, he's going to unleash. He gets really big. He's 11,000 power. And he can't block him. So he's going to break that shield. There's so much cool strategy. Uh oh, shield blast. No spike. Uh -oh, no. And then. I'm going to attack with this guy. I'll put you on the ropes. You have to block. Alright. And he gets banished. Oh, yeah. He's crunchy. We call it crunchy. Yeah. 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 Master. Y'all see it. Y'all see it. Don't keep her alive. Double card. transform essence. Yes. Lemon. Haven. Yeah. Double spine yeah. over. Wow. <laughs> Blockade. GG. Spine over. I tap all. Yeah. Like, oh, so Are you it's all right. Right. Yeah. It's all good. It's going to be a little break soon. What you got? Six. That's a huge blocker! Nice! That'll work, that stops my guy! Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and you the first time you have the light, it's good. Uh, Micah? Okay. And on my next turn, I can summon this. No. I'll play this guy. And then I can attack, but really, you're just gonna block. So I'm gonna pass it. Sometimes you just gotta swarm the field and have more guys and they have block. And it just simply comes down to who's got more dudes. Yeah, that's a good one. What you got? Uh, you're not gonna like it. Oh, it's all good. It's all good. Do we have seven right here? I think we have seven, right? Yeah. You can charge to eight, right? I'm, I am going to draw. <laughs> no, we already drew. You already drew. So let's put that one back. It's all good. Who wants to get quiet? I'm going to attack those six. Another blocker? No, tree. Nice. And then I'm going to choose a uh, Striding heart. heart. Ooh, I don't think you should do that. Because then you can't block them. Yeah. Uh, then again, I have two guys too. Do you have another blocker? In hand? In hand? Any of them with the blocker symbol? Uh, no? I'm gonna leave him alone to block whatever you can throw at. Two attackers. Yeah. Exactly. So if you want, you can attack. It's up to you. Mm -hmm. But I think I got you. Yeah. 
Just simply outnumbered. Wow, gonna... But if you want to attack just for fun, yeah. 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 I can block too. Ah, yeah. yeah. I can block you too, Kevin. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna like. First game, he. Okay. Bye, go. All right. Ended up dropping a Kalima. And got a bore on that one. I'm gonna have some fun while I do it. So. Because you, you can do an evolution onto an evolution. It's kind of cool. And then I'm gonna attack. I'm gonna unleash. And when this creature unleashes, target 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 enemy creature to target target creature. So you have more than you can do. This guy. And then attack. And then the second ability is for the creature you destroy. Good games, man. Good games. Did you have fun? All right. So, uh, all right, guys, that's uh, me playing the prep deck. And I want to say shout outs to Zach Hine for building it and posting it on the Petrodo.com website. And uh, Mac Hunter, thank you for coming today. I hope we uh, left a good taste in your mouth and you guys come back. So, hopefully, we can just pop you play. And uh, Nico, yeah. Nico, you'll be joining us as well. Yeah. Uh, he's giving you a bunch of cards and he's giving you girls and stuff like that. Uh, I think it's been a great day. Lots of good stuff. Uh, it was really cool hearing your story about how you found it on Netflix, and then found the card game, and then found the card game style of the night. That's just too cool. I, wanted to try, I, I actually got the card game two weeks ago. I wanted to try it out, and yeah. I saw it in the store. So I asked my grandma if she would buy it. Yeah. And she said, yes, I have Dragon Master Kid, and I told them that I had never played before. So they gave me the five civilization slot for the, uh, for, uh, 2014. The 2014 Star Deck. Yeah, yeah. Cool. So Comic Asylum is doing good. That's yes. good to hear. That's really good. So, uh... For, for Hunter B, I'm Carl Reddish. Hope you guys enjoy this. Leave a like, comment, subscribe to the community. Bye, guys.